U.S. and Philippines launch military drills with partners as China tensions mount, the United States military kicked off two weeks of multilateral exercises with its Philippine allies and multiple international partners on Monday amid rising tensions between Manila and Beijing over territorial disputes in the South China Sea. Maritime Training Activity Sama Sama 2023 is the seventh and largest iteration of the drills as participants from Australia, Canada, France, Japan, the United Kingdom and Malaysia joined the U.S. and the Philippines, according to a U.S. Navy press release. The exercises off the Philippine coast will include drills on anti-submarine, surface and air warfare as well as land phases. The release said, in Tagalog Sama Sama, is a phrase that means, together, and there could not be a better phrase to capture the spirit of this exercise, said Captain Sean Lewis, Commodore of the U.S. Navy's Destroyer Squadron 7, in the release. Together we can address a spectrum of security threats and enhance interoperability and with more nations participating than ever before. We can increase innovation and build a ready, united force that ensures stability in the region, he said. Stability in the region is seen as being increasingly threatened by confrontations between Chinese Coast Guard and maritime militia units and Philippine vessels around disputed features in the South China Sea. From territorial defense to countering transnational crimes, Sama Sama, helps, us to face an array of threats together, the Chief of the Philippine Navy, Vice Admiral Toribio Adesai Jr., said at opening ceremonies in Manila on Monday, according to the state-run Philippine News Agency, PNA, dot, in an exclusive interview with CNN last week. Philippine Defense Secretary Gilberto Teodoro Jr. equated Chinese behavior in the region to that of a schoolyard bully, recent incidents that have the region. On edge include Chinese water cannons blocking the resupply of a shipwrecked Philippine Milita.